Welcome back to the Mexican Food Channel. In today's video, we're going to be making this delicious chamoy pickle. Stay tuned. These are all the ingredients and let's not forget the pickles. Since dill pickles are my favorite, I'm going to be using these. Since I'm only doing two, I'm going to go ahead and separate them. I don't like that pickle, so I'm going to go ahead and switch it. Go ahead and poke holes all over your pickles. This will help the chamoy absorb them. <laughs> Oh, man. Yeah, just poke holes on the pickles. I'm gonna put these in a smaller jar because we're gonna have to put them in chamoy. We're going to fill up the jar one third of the way with pickle juice. This is my favorite chamoy, it's the best. Now we're gonna fill it up with chamoy all the way to the top. We're going to seal it and shake it till we get it all mixed up. Shake, shake, shake. In case you are wondering what chamoy it is, the brand is called Alamo Candy. And then two days later, they're ready. But you're more than welcome to let them sit more than two days. Mmm, that looks good. Next, we're going to cut them both in half. So we can fill them up, we're going to cut out the center. Now that we cut off the center, we're going to fill them in with these.
Next, we're gonna sprinkle it with tajin, low sodium. On two of these, we're gonna sprinkle the chamoy flavor Lucas. On the other two, we're gonna use the mango flavor Lucas. Next, give it a splash of Lucas Chamoy. You can also use these. Oh snap, I almost forgot about the fruit roll-up. Go ahead and take one and wrap one half of your pickle. We're gonna put this wooden stick so we can hold them properly while we eat them. Go ahead and give it another splash of Lucas Chamoy and another sprinkle of Chamoy flavor Lucas. And they're ready, time for the taste test, yay! And that's it guys, I hope you guys enjoy. Don't forget to like and subscribe and hit the bell. Thanks for watching.